how I made this surreal scene in Blender. So let's get started. Add a plane, scale it and subdivide it. Delete the middle vertice and select the vertices which are inside. Now scale down the vertices. Now with the same vertices selected extrude them on z-axis and again extrude the vertices and scale it. Repeat this step and make stairs and fill the center. After that add ghost asset. Which I made from cloth simulation the video on how to make this cloth simulation. The link is in description. So after placing the ghost add a cube. Scale it down and make cuboid for the wall pillar. Adjust the pillar behind the ghost. Apply array modifier to the pillar and increase the count. Now add a plane and subdivide it. Select the inside vertices extruded on z-axis. Extrude and scale it again. Extrude it again on z-axis. Now add a camera and align it to the camera view. Enable the thirds and frame the scene. After that duplicate the pillar and place it in opposite direction. Now add a cube and make cuboid and place according to your requirement. Now set the render engine to cycles. Add plane and place it behind the cuboids. Now in shader editor remove principled BSDF and add a mission shader to the plane and increase the intensity. Add a plane again for water. Now add a bump node and connect to normal of principled BSDF and add noise texture connected to the bump node. Now adjust the noise and make water texture. Also increase the transmission and decrease the roughness. Now change the light colors to blue and orange. The blue is area light places behind the pillars for adding rim light to ghost. Now add a cube scale it, till the whole scene fits in the cube. Now in shader editor remove principled BSDF and add principled volume. Adjust the density to add volume in the scene. After that add concrete texture to all the elements in the scene. You can also add elements according to your imagination. Adjust camera and lighting according to your requirements. You are done. Go for the final render do some color grading and appreciate your work. If you love my renders and tutorials, make sure to subscribe for more such tutorials. And also follow me on Instagram at Archivisuals.